Greetings all, Frog here, let's play GeoGuessr. Uh, it's Tuesday, so we would normally do the Statelands Challenge, but unless I'm going crazy, I don't see a Statelands Challenge posted to the Reddit sub form. So what I'm going to, subreddit we call that, what I'm going to do is play another Mr. Bearded Bread Challenge. This is American Interiors, and it's the sixth one, so I don't know if it's just going to kind of transition to this instead of doing the other one. I don't know, but this is what we're going to do. So the only rule, we can move around as much as we want inside, but we cannot escape to the outside. That would be cheating. So we're going to be inside. Looking around, this looks really familiar. Like, I might have been here before. It looks kind of like... Um, no, it's not what I thought it was. Okay, that's probably good for me. Uh, Jim Hilker is the name. Champ Lane. Way to science. Oh yeah, this is not what I thought it was. Okay, so that's good. Northfield Savings Bank Theater, a National Geographic experience. Northfield Savings Bank. That that right there is a panda. All right, so we can go anywhere we want inside. We but we cannot go outside. That's a telephone. That's old school tech right there. All right, anything on the ceilings? No, nope, not really. I mean, everything's in English, but uh, we expected that since we're in America. One Drop Cafe. It does not look edible. Animal Care closed. That's funny. I like that, by the way. That's cute. Um, hmm. Please remove shoes. I got that covered. Thank you. It's the YMCA. We're helping plan and test Champ Lane. Let's grow kids. Some sort of YMCA, some sort of king, something, something, something. We cannot go onto roads. We can go anywhere else. Okay, that's all we get. There's no floors. Champ, Champ, Lake Champlain. Hmm. Lake Champlain. Classic rock station, Champ, 101.3. Samuel de Champlain saw a something foot serpent think as a thick as a barrel. The head of a horse. Iroquois. Well, that's New York. I mean, Lake Champlain is in New York. At least there is one. Pretty sure. I don't know what the V is for. Now let's go check out Lake Champlain. There's no time limit on this, right? No, okay, good. Thank God. Is that Lake Champlain? No, that's Oneida. Possibly Oneida. These are the Finger Lakes. Is that one of the Finger Lakes? I don't recall. I think I'm thinking of the wrong Champagne. But this is where the Iroquois would be. Mm -hmm. That's a river. It's like Champlain, not in New York. That's the Hudson. Chautauqua? As falls Chautauqua, so falls Chautauqua. No, that's not actually a thing. That's a river. Alright. Abenaki and Iroquois. Iroquois were also in Michigan. But I'm pretty sure there's not a Lake Champagne in Michigan. P.T. Barnum. near St. Albans. It's a V. Mm -hmm. Basin residents, young and old. Which, the Lake Champlain, probably. 
Some people believe Champ is part of the remnant Plesiosaur population trapped when Lake Champlain was cut off from the ocean. The ocean's over here. Champlain in... I mean, Iroquois were freaking all over the place in the north. Off from the ocean. Is this a separate... Is this a, is this a thing? Iroquois weren't... Because isn't there... Isn't, isn't this... Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Matt, we're going crazy. Because isn't this also Lake Champagne down here? Not that one. Where is it? It's a, it's a big one. It's the one that t that touches New Orleans, isn't it? First off, let me get it back. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, it's Ponchart Train. Okay, good. I was worried about that. All right, so my my zoom is, is way too good. Lake Champagne. Cut off from the ocean. It's in... Okay, so Vermont. All right, very good. Also New York. Okay, all right. Fantastic. Which side? <laughs> Which side am I in? Okay. It's a very cool science museum. It's taking six and a half minutes to go for this first guess. I mean, the guy was wearing a V. Let's say we're on the Vermont side. Is there a, some sort of science museum in Burlington? The Echo Lehigh Center for Lake Champaign. Community room, Lakeside Pavilion, Omni room. Changing exhibit gallery. Water column. Could be. Let's say we're in here. That's pretty good. That's because we're in here. Oh, excuse me! We were in the center, so you gotta mock me down. That's understandable. Four floors! Marcel de Lima. That is a ruse. We are in the United States. Actually, I don't know if that's true because it says America, so maybe we're in Canada. are you? A statesman of some sort. Oh, why do you have to be gold on gold? Tough to see. Maybe I could ask a docent. That's elevators. Excuse me, miss. Yes, excuse me. I would like some information. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Joseph Smith Memorial Building. We are in the Joseph Smith Memorial Building. There's ten levels, but we can only go up to the fourth. Which takes us to Family Search, Product Engineering, Member Needs. Level three is Family Search, Patron Service, Family and Church History, Mission Administration, Public Affairs Department, Joseph Smith. That name should mean something to me. Actually, I'll bet we can only go one, two, three, four. Are we on the second floor? We're not. Salt like ensign steak. Joseph Smith. Is this man is this the the, the dude that founded uh Mormonism. Mormon. Yeah, I believe so. We're in the Joseph Smith Memorial Building. Might as well check it out. Bam, level two. What do we got? Oh, we got a banquet set up. I'll have the chicken. It's snowing outside. Oh, we have a wedding. Live and in progress. This is probably why there are photospheres in here. 
Because this dude was the... No, Marcel de Lima was probably the wedding photographer. Wow, she's gorgeous. Nice dress. Well done, milady. Well done. Although that's not set up for the banquet anymore. Beautiful architecture. Alright, what's on, on floor three? Third floor. More banquet space. Across the street from the Plaza Hotel. Wow, look at that architecture. Never been to Salt Lake. Have you? We're in the hallway. Right past the altar and out the door! The Jubilee Suite. Alright, as far as we are, let's go uh, see what's on the fourth floor. Piano's everywhere. I love it. Nice cake. It's a different wedding. This place can have weddings through the wazoo. Even for the great kazoo. Huh? Nice fountain. Oh, this is a big wedding party. Oh no, we just looped back in. Okay. Well, I mean, we're in Salt Lake City. I always forget where Utah is. There we go. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Isn't it in Provo? Let's check Provo first, it's smaller. Dragon's Keep sounds like a gaming store. I'm interested. Provo City Center Temple. That doesn't sound like the Joseph Smith Memorial Building. Provo Town Center, that's a, that's a mall, that is. Okay. Is it in Orm? No, more strip malls, more strip malls. Okay, so it probably is in Salt Lake City. Then. Salt Lake City. Where are you, Salt Lake City? Here you are. All right. Calvin L. Redemption, Redemption Salt Palace Convention Center. That's not it. It says Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I mean, that's that's who we're talking about. But that doesn't say the memorial building. So I don't know. I'm torn. Are you across the street from a palace? This is probably the Church History Museum. It's not. Damn. Oh, I just had to took one more! One more and I would have been in there! One more! No! No! I lose because I'm too lazy. We've never heard that before. Okay! Hey, nice bar. I'll take, um... Well, they're not likely to have a Buna Havan, so I guess I'll take a Glenlivet 15 neat. Thanks. This is like the kitschiest of kitschy places I have ever seen. Likely to be in New York. We cannot go outside. This is ultra kitschy. It's the shaft. Not likely to be in New York. Subterranean gift shop, men's and women's western wear. We cannot go downstairs. Tombstone, Arizona, that says. I don't know what to believe. That's FDNY. Is that the Arizona State flag? Couldn't tell you. Why would it have a Confederate flag? This is very confusing stuff. Big Nose Kate is the special. Sex in the Desert. Tequila Sunfire. Big Nose Kate's Saloon. That's where we are, in point of fact. Well, okay, fine. Tombstone, Arizona. I don't know where Tombstone is. It's a good thing we have a large map. Oh, there it is! Tombstone, Arizona. Oh, that's where the OK Corral was, indeed. Indeed. 
Tombstone Harley Davidson. Doc Holiday Saloon. No, that's not Doc's. This is Kate's place. Morgan's Cafe. Tombstone Wine Works. No, I need Kate's place. Put it somewhere in Tombstone, we'll probably be okay. That's Katie's Cozy Cabins. Saloon could be in here, maybe. Hmm. It's a different si this is a different type of game. I like it. There it is. Big Nose Kate's Saloon. We're here. Very good. Uh, it's a subway. All persons are forbidden to enter across the tracks. Yes, even if they're Pokemon. It's the court station. Okay, danger, live tracks. Not so sure. That does not look like a live uh, thing. This looks more like a museum to me. I'm assuming this is going to go up, but we're going to go in this way anyway. It does not. Okay. Oh, it's like the dispatch room. Oh, cool. Check that out. Wow, look at all the train lines that come out of this thing. It's a complicated station. That's old stuff, man. Cannot read that. If you can, good for you. I applaud your fine eyesight. Mine is not that good. Welcome to the Nicholas Pantelides Memorial Signal Tower. Founding trustee of Friends of the New York Transit Museum. In addition to a long and successful career in the electrical construction industry, Nick was a tireless fundraiser for the Transit Museum. All right, well, we're probably at the New York Transit Museum. Where the hell is that? I mean, look, I know it's in NYC, but it's a big city. This is the Transit Museum by Wall Street. I feel like that's the case. Where's my head? There's so many damn museums. Transit Museum is not in Wall Street. Well, might be, I guess. What's this museum? It's the Francis Tavern Museum. It's not exactly it. I feel like the Transit Museum would be bigger. Like, at the level of the World Trade Center. Problem is, I was only in New York twice. Once we didn't even go to the city, and the second time, it was not a great experience for me. We're not going to go into that because it's not important. But we didn't really go to many touristy places. We did do a lot of Wall Street stuff, though. So I guess I should have known it wasn't there, or we would have gone because I love trains. So there's no way. I wouldn't have gone in to the transit museum. So, might as well at least go to the second floor and see what's here. Can't go that way. Definitely the transit museum. No question about that. <sighs> Bully. Oh boy, we can go in the gift shop.
I have no idea where this is. Look, I don't think it's... I don't think it's uptown. I don't think it's in the Bronx. I think I've really... I think it's in Manhattan, but... Know that for sure. Oh, where is the transit museum? Grand Central's in Manhattan somewhere. Where are all the trains? There's all the trains. Remember me to Herald Square. National Museum of Mathematics. I found the National Museum of Mathematics, but I can't find the damn transit museum. Is this something stupid like it's on Staten Island? Where's Staten Island? I don't remember where Staten Island is for all this. This whole big thing is Staten Island. I don't know why it would be on Staten Island. It doesn't appear to be on Staten Island. Damn it. Don't bother. That boy ain't right. Tenement Museum. How do I find the Tenement Museum, but not the damn Transit Museum? Ugh. I found the M Museum M. It's like every other museum except the one that I need. Museum of the American Indian. Wonderful, fantastic museums. Very interesting things. I mean, fantastically interesting. Just not the one I want. Oh, hell, we're just gonna get bad score. I'm not gonna take forever on this. It is in Brooklyn. Damn. Alright. Whoa! What's up? Space? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This looks familiar. This is Detroit. The grand city of Detroit. This is the uh, top floor of the Renaissance Center. I believe it's the top floor. It's a restaurant on the top floor. I used to come up here as a kid. Yeah, that's absolutely. That's that's uh, one of the Renaissance towers. We're in the center. That's the the it's the Joe or Kobo. I can't. I never remember which one. I think that's Kobo. That's the Joe. I don't know. It's back to back. That's Hart Plaza. That's Comerica Park. That's Ford Field. Oh yeah, you can see the Ford logo. Detroit. If you grew up in Detroit, you know why I say it that way. At least if you watch hockey, which if you grew up in Detroit, pretty good chance you did. Yeah, that's glorious. I didn't realize there was a private dining room in here. It's the only place in the world that you can drive due south into Canada. Yeah, that's it. It's Hart Plaza. I think that's Rensen 1. I don't remember what the, the number of the towers are, but... Yeah, I remember this, this very much so. Uh, it's my dad used to work for Ford. Back when they owned the building. It's GM now, but... 
That's cool. It's Lafayette. is a tunnel underneath uh, Kobo Arena. That's Kobo. The Joe's on the other side. I guess it's under Kobo Hall. Kobo Arena, Kobo Hall. Used to be an indoor soccer team that played at Kobo. That's very cool. Renaissance Center. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. There's Kobo. Oh, Joe's on the back. That's what it is. That's the Kobo Arena. That's Kobo Center now, the whole thing. Oh, you could show you, show you the, the failed experiment that was the uh, People Mover. There it is. That's the track. It should have been fantastic. It was, at its time, the height of design. And then they just never finished it. I mean, finish the, the People Mover, man. And it would have been amazing. We're on the top of this tower right here. It's going to dock me a point because we're, like, probably on this side of it. You know what I mean? But there it is. Adiamo has a riverfront restaurant? It's good Italian. They don't sponsor this, but... You're going to dock me three points. And I, I knew it almost instantly. You're going to dock me three. Uh, we were not... Oh, no, sir. I beg to differ. We were not on that side of the tower. No, 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 my friends. We were on this side for sure. That's shady. That's shady, GeoGuessr. That's shady. 32-169 is a pretty darn good score, though. I might actually have to post the results into the... Uh, uh, click to get shared. We'll do that later. But I think, uh, I think, you know, we did some pretty good times there. That was pretty good. 32-169. It certainly helps that, you know, I spent my childhood in, in one of them. And uh, we figured it out. 26 minutes. That's not too bad. It's about the time of a Statelands challenge, so I liked it. Uh, thank you so much, Bearded Bread, for curating that challenge. I liked, uh, liked it very much. Hope you guys did, too. If you did, click the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel to stay updated to everything as it happens. And until next time, cheers.